Nicole's got here Mobile Geeks and here we are at IDF Beijing 2013. I'm checking out the new Baytrail platform which has just been launched here at IDF and you can see that it is a new SOC um, aimed at the desktop and the mobile space. There's the M for Mobile, D for desktop. Uh, we have a desktop version right here uh, of sample by Gigabyte. There's the board in there. Uh, you can see that over here they've capped it at 1.6 gigahertz uh, up to 8 gigs of RAM, uh, but all this is capped. There's no word on what the frequencies are going to be. But here's the exciting part. We have a prototype clamshell device uh, by ASUS. It's currently running the Bay Trail processor, a quad core. Uh, we're running a, a HD video. I think this is a 25 by 16, so this is even bigger than 1080p full HD. But if we take a quick look at this Bay Trail system, this prototype by ASUS, it looks like the UX21, but um, of course it's officially not. If we take a look around the system, we have the PSU, we have the drop down for the Ethernet, HDMI, USB 3.0, USB 2.0, Kensington lock here. Full keyboard, you can see the display looks great. Uh, the resolution of the the resolution of, of the display is also going to be HD supported, like not like not just the video. The yeah, so so it will also support uh, full HD screens as well. On this other side, we have a multi-card reader, a two-in-one audio microphone jack, another USB 2.0, and full VGA yeah, port. Also have USB 3. And USB 3 on the other yeah, side. On the other side. On the other side. Uh, if we take a quick look, at the the display, the, the screen does look great. You can see that. Um, it's running perfectly. If we kind of put our hand under the bottom, it's super cool. I'm just going to give this a, a little bit of a close here. Oh, I love it. It's blue. But if we feel the bottom, it's not hot at all and it's been running this HD video for quite a while. So this has just been a quick first look. Yeah, hold that down for me. <laughs> at uh, the new Baytrail processor by by Intel running on the ASUS prototype over here. So as we learn more about Baytrail, we'll be sure to you know, let you know what we find out. But it does have hardware acceleration, and including um, Intel's video QuickSync, and of course you'll see up there it's DirectX 11. Um, like I said, there's not that much information currently out on Baytrail. We're going to have to wait a little bit longer to find out exactly what we're going to be seeing. But we will be seeing devices in 2013 for Christmas. Nicole Scott here from Mobile Geeks at Intel's IDF Beijing. Okay.